We want to turn right now to the coronavirus here in Connecticut. After being closed for the first time ever, the state's two casinos are set to reopen their doors. Now, once again, the governor making it clear he does not agree with this and is asking the tribes to do more. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Matthew Campbell is joining us now live. And Matthew, what exactly is the governor looking for? Well, Aaron, the governor has asked for the casinos not to reopen for at least another two weeks, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. So he's asking for safer measures. And right now, the casinos revealed their safety plans. It includes plastic dividers at tables, limiting players at tables, turning off every other slot machine. And they also installed these UV light devices and air ducts, which are supposed to act as a disinfectant. Now, the casinos are not limiting where players can come from. And that's what troubles the governor. He feels since Connecticut's casinos could be the first to open. We're going to see traffic from all over the eastern seaboard and beyond. And he says opening on the first is just too early. It's earlier than Las Vegas. It's earlier than any of our regional um, uh, casinos want to do. I'd like to have a little more time. Short of that, I'd like them to put in stricter protocols. I think that's key for the public health of customers going in, their employees in the greater region. Now, you heard the governor talk more about strict protocols. He's looking at casinos in other states to see what they're doing. Some of those examples coming up at 5. But for now, live above the news are Matthew Campbell, Channel 13 News.